Welcome to our first live demo here at PAC Expo Connects. Thank you so much for joining us today. My name is Victoria Sithi and sitting here with me is Felons Foodie and banding expert for the food industry, Lisa Berrio. Thanks for joining us today, Lisa. Thank you, I'm really excited to be here. We're really excited too. Now before we dive into everything, I'd like to point out that Lisa also has two other live demos this week. Today she will be discussing adhesive-free labeling with ultrasonic banding with us. And later this week, she will be discussing automatic sleeving with ultrasonic banding for skin packs and more, and also creating club packs and multi-packs with sustainability in mind. We're excited to talk with you about adhesive-free labeling today. It's really a premium form of labeling. It really is. Now, before we dive into all of that, we also have a couple housekeeping items that we'd like to touch on. We have a group chat as part of this live demo, so please feel free to leave comments and ask questions, and we will answer them as we go. If you need to duck out early but want to learn more, just type contact me in the chat and someone will reach out to you. We will also have a link at the end of this discussion that will allow you to have a video chat with Lisa via Zoom so that you can ask her additional questions as well. And before we dive into adhesive-free labeling, I'd like to know, Lisa, could you tell us a little bit more about yourself and how you got into the role that you're in at Felons? Absolutely. So I've actually been with Felons for about five years and I absolutely love the company culture. It's a fantastic place to work. And specifically, I really love working with the food industry. I'm actually a foodie both at home and in my role with felons. I am a health nut. I love to cook. I love growing my own herbs. I make kombucha and I love learning about various food trends. So working with the food industry has really been a treat. And I actually have really grown to like learning about their pain points and things that really impact the food industry so I can better help my customers. I also really enjoy working with the ultrasonic banding equipment. It's super robust and I love seeing it add value to these food manufacturing plants. And I like also seeing how it makes a marketing impact with these beautiful adhesive free sustainable labels. That is awesome. It sounds like you're really passionate about what you do. I really am. Yeah, I love That's food. <laughs> and I noticed that you mentioned ultrasonic banding, yes. but what exactly is adhesive free labeling? Yeah, so typically in the food industry, especially at the retail level, you see labels being applied with glues and adhesives. And what's unique about ultrasonic banding is that we actually don't require glues or adhesives to be applied. We use ultrasonic technology. So we actually weld the material to itself. So when you remove the band, we're not leaving a sticky residue on the product. Awesome. And yeah. could you explain a little bit more about this weld? Yeah, so different from a heat seal bander, with ultrasonics, we actually use high frequency, low amplitude vibrations on the material. This actually moves the molecules in the material, which makes the material weld to itself. It's super unique. Wow. It's, uh, it's actually what we like to call a cold weld. So it's pretty cool, <laughs> pun intended. <laughs> and that sounds great. What does, how do, how do the adhesive-free labels come? Yeah, so when you receive your adhesive-free label, it comes on a roll of material, which is about 2,500 feet of material per roll. Wow. And this gets loaded into a banding machine. And what's really unique is because we don't use glues or adhesives, we actually don't require a liner. So at the plant level, this is a huge benefit because you're not filling these trash bins with liners. So it really is a sustainable alternative. Wow, that is a really good point. It's waste free and everything yeah, like that. Yeah. Um, back to the discussion of the ultrasonic weld, what does this look like to the consumer? How Do they need cutting tools to remove the, the material? Sure, this is a really great point. A lot of people, when they initially see this ultrasonic weld, they think this is a really strong weld. But actually, what's really unique is we can make adjustments through the HMI on site to adjust that weld setting. So you can have anything from a peelable weld to a very strong weld where you actually would require cutting tools and everything in between. And I actually have a video that I'd love to be able to share with you that shows the contrast between removing an adhesive label, one that's specifically like very strong adhesive, and how that compares to removing an ultrasonic adhesive-free label. So we, let's check it out. Awesome.
wow, that band was so much easier to remove from the right? product than the adhesive label was. It's very cool. It's very consumer friendly. Yeah, it yeah. is. And could you tell us how does the band not fall off of the product without adhesives? This is a really good point because we're not using glues or adhesives. So you would think like, why doesn't this just fall off the product? <laughs> right. But we actually, we marry the ultrasonic welding technology with tension the good kind. <laughs> um, it's it's really cool. So we can actually adjust the tension settings through the HMI on the machine and depending on the product we can make adjustments. So for an example with a rigid tray we typically can get away with using what we call fixed length where essentially we come down on the product the same uh, size every single time. This is really nice with pre-printed film. You're always going to have the top of the label appear on the top every single time. Right. For a product such as a multi-pack, we're trying to hold all the elements in the bundle together and we can really use tension uh, to its fullest in this type of application by adjusting the soft tension settings by increasing and decreasing the percentage of tension on the product so that way we can really dial that in without squeezing the guts out of the product <laughs> and uh, actually being able to hold the middle product without the bundle falling apart. Nice, okay. And that sounds like a really unique way to not only label but bundle products. Yeah, absolutely. Could you tell us what other types of products could benefit from this technology? Yeah, so um, honestly when it comes to retail food products there are various applications that adhesive free labeling works really well with. To name a few types of, of products, I think thermoform packs, skin packs, trays, obviously multi-packs. These are great uh, products that benefit from adhesive free labeling and I'd actually like to show you two examples that I have today. So the first one is this Columbus Craft Meats tray and as you can see the bottom of the tray the compartments are different sizes to accommodate the size of the product and with an adhesive label the label doesn't really lay flat and doesn't adhere to the tray well because of these uneven compartments where the ultrasonic band has this nice flat surface. Also this customer was very interested in working with a paper band versus a plastic label so this makes for a beautiful black paper premium band that I, I know they really love. And with the second example, we have this Amy Lou multi-pack. So this is actually a unique example of adhesive-free labeling because we're, we're acting as the label and we're unitizing the product and keep, keeping it from falling apart at the retail level. And when the consumer removes that band, there's no longer this sticky residue so it doesn't stick to the refrigerator. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah. And you mentioned that on that snack tray that they used a paper band. Yeah. What other types of materials can the customer use? Yeah, so I'd love to show you. Uh, typically, when we are working with the customer, we will send them this pre-printed material booklet. And at a high level, it, it just has some examples of our different types of material that we offer. So we can offer anything from about an inch wide band all the way up to just under a four inch wide band. And here you can see the various substrates and print qualities. So to answer your question, we can run anything from paper, plastic, transparent film, or compostable material, all depending on the marketing and branding needs. And one thing I really want to point out that I'm super excited to share with everybody is that unique to other forms of labeling, whatever substrate you pick, you don't have to stick with for the rest of your life. So with the ultrasonic banding equipment, you can switch between paper or plastic at any given moment by just swapping out the material. So it's really one solution that fits multiple needs. Wow, it sounds like it's a very flexible yeah. uh, type of equipment. It really is. And could you possibly tell us how the banding material is applied to the product? Um, what type of equipment is needed in this process? Sure, so we offer both manual, automation ready, and fully automated ultrasonic banding equipment. And this is what applies this adhesive free label. And with this equipment, we offer this in both, uh, I'm sorry, powder coat, uh, food grade paint, as well as stainless steel frames. And one thing to point out is even if you were to move forward with a powder coat machine, all of the parts of the machine that come in direct contact with the food are stainless. So it still That's is a, a food safe solution. Mm -hmm. And we can actually customize these machines by integrating it with a thermal transfer printer for printing variable data such as expiration dates, wow. lot numbers, barcodes, anything you like. And this is great for the food industry because these products are typically perishable. So it's nice to be able to put that information directly onto the band. We can also make some other customization uh, or have other 
customization options with these machines. For example, right behind you, Vicki, we have an example of the material is being loaded above the arch. And this is beneficial for a very okay. wet environment oh, where typically gotcha. the ground is wet or they have to hose down the ground. So we're keeping that material away from the ground. And so these are basically the, the base models we're talking about for banding. And I actually have a video I'd love to show you that shows how easy to, these machines are to use. Uh, so let's go ahead and check that out. All right. Very cool. Right? Yeah. Um, so another video I have for you is demonstrating what our full automation looks like. So you saw what the manual machine looks like, and mm -hmm. that's really what our automation is built around. It just depends on the application, whether you're looking to run a single product or a multi-pack. So let's go ahead and check out that video. All right. Wow, that was really interesting. Right. And if some of our viewers would like to see their product uh, banded with the adhesive free labels, what are the next steps for that? So if anyone is interested in moving forward with adhesive free labeling, we would ask that you go ahead and send in product samples to us and then I'll work directly with you to talk about what your application needs are. For example, what are your volumes? What is your, your footprint like? Are you looking for a manual solution or a fully automated solution? And then when we receive the samples, we will go ahead and put together an application video for you and send you a private YouTube link so you can actually see your product being banded. We then return the samples as long as well as uh, with these pre-printed material booklets and then help you with the designing of the material or the artwork onto the band by providing you guys with die lines as well and then we can talk about budgetary pricing. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. All right, thank you so much Lisa for joining us today. Thank Unfortunately, you. we have to wrap up our discussion. Yes, no, thank you so much for having me. It's really been a blast and I can talk about ultrasonic banding and adhesive free <laughs> labeling all the time. So once again, if anybody has any questions or is interested in trying adhesive free labeling with their product, please go ahead and message us and I look forward to seeing some of you on that Zoom call here shortly. Awesome. And if you didn't have a chance to have your question answered in the chat, just go ahead and enter contact me in the live chat and someone will reach out to you. Alternatively, you can also reach out to Lisa, not only in the Zoom chat, but also via her virtual business card on our PAC Expo Connects page. We also have a ton of information on our website at felons.com.